Shalom everybody, just wanted to give a quick uh, reminder. Tonight and tomorrow is the fifth night of Hanukkah. We are lighting the fifth candle. As we learn from great sages, great tzaddikim, and amazing rabbis in our history, in our past, that say that the fifth night of Hanukkah has a very strong power, a sgula, a remedy, for people who cannot find their other half or are seeking to get married, to recite a few prayers on that day, and this day is a very powerful and auspicious time for single people to find their other half. And also if you decide to pray for somebody who's single, your child, your friend, it's a very powerful day. The Rebbe from Slonin adds on that, that if uh, the fifth uh, candle, the fifth night falls on Erev Shabbat, it's even a more auspicious time. Many ask why specifically the fifth day and not the fourth or the third. Because the, uh, the great rabbi in our generation, Rabbi Chaim Kanievsky, says in the name of his father, the stipler, that a big part of the prayer is also giving a little bit of charity. And the fifth night of Hanukkah never falls on Shabbat. That way a person can pray, have their request, and in the merits for it to be answered, they give a little bit of uh, charity. So there are many other remedies and explanations we want to cut this video short. I just wanted to remind you that tonight and tomorrow is the fifth day of Hanukkah. Please look underneath this video, wherever you look at the video, social media or WhatsApp, look for the link, which will take you to the page where we posted there the prayers that one needs to recite. It's not a lot, shouldn't take you a long time. Go there, read the prayers, share it with people. And uh, I will be going tomorrow to the grave of Yonatan ben Uziel, what is called Amuka, where uh, is a very, very powerful place where everybody who is seeking to get married goes there to pray. I will go there tomorrow and I will recite the prayers myself. And uh, I pray as usual on the behalf of many, many people. So you can use the same page where you will find these prayers to submit your names. I will gladly pray on your behalf. That Hashem should bless you and anybody else to find their true other half, their true soulmate. Have a long, happy marriage life. For the ones who are already married, I'm blessing you to have a wonderful marriage life where you can grow together and build a beautiful home. Don't let these powerful days go past without doing anything. The prayers are short. It's only a few chapters of Tehillim and a few other verses to read. Go to the link underneath the video, around the video, wherever you find it. Look for the prayers. Submit names if you want to, pray, and, and, and I wish you and everybody who's seeking to get married to find their other half easy and fast. Also on that page will be some instructions of things that you need to do besides the prayers, because this year the fifth night of Hanukkah falls on Erev Shabbat, on the Friday, which uh, as I told you, the Rebbe from Sloning said that it's even a, a much more auspicious time, so simply visit the page Follow the instructions. It's very simple. S recite the prayers. Share it with people. And may Hashem bless the entire nation. Hashem bless us all to find our other half and, and find true happiness. I'm already going to wish you Shabbat Shalom. This is a very, very, very powerful Shabbat. It's Shabbat. On top of that is Hanukkah. And on top of that is Rosh Chodesh, the head of the month of Tevet. So we have a triple Power. This is a powerful, powerful Shabbat. Increase in prayers, increase in Torah learning. Eat your Shabbat meals with great pleasure. Learn Torah. Do whatever you can to climb this spiritual ladder, to, to, to grow spiritually and to affect yourself, to change the world, to, to change yourself. And, and I really, I, I can't stress enough how powerful these days are. It's like taking candy you know what, this is a bad example. It's like I was about to say like taking candy from kids, but we're not taking candy from kids. We're just taking the candies off the trees of blessings of Hashem. Hashem is just giving us these blessings. Just grab it. So I wish you all great success. A wonderful Shabbat. Happy Hanukkah. Amazing Rosh Chodesh. All the best. And I'll see you in the next video updating you about our Rosh Chodesh prayers on Sunday. And Zot Hanukkah. On Monday, we have powerful, powerful days in front of us. Take advantage. All the best.